Bean Path in Jackson is turning five years old. That's right, and Executive Director Kanika Welch is here to tell us how they're celebrating their fifth anniversary. Kanika, thank you so much for being with us. Tell us again, remind us of what the Bean Path is. Sure, so the Bean Path is a tech-focused nonprofit. Um, our mission is to bridge the digital divide by connecting people to tech literacy, um, workforce training, and small business development. Right. So how are you celebrating your fifth anniversary then? Well, we have planned some great events uh, this week. It started this morning with our founder, Dr. Nashley Cephas, who gave a talk at JSU. Um, on Thursday, Friday, we're going to have a tech network networking mixer. And at this event, if you are into tech or maybe you want to get into tech, it's an opportunity to network with some of the tech professionals right here in our local community. And then we're all going to top it off on Saturday with our community event that we have every year. Only this year is really special because we're hosting it at the Bean Barn instead of our makerspace facility. The Bean Barn, where is the Bean Barn? So the Bean Barn is on Gallatin Street and this is the second development of the what will be the Jackson Tech District and so this will be our second event that we're hosting there so we're really excited to have the community to come out check out the space um, and just see what we're doing in downtown Jackson. Yeah. Yeah. Were you always a, a, a techie? I mean you always loved I was not out. always a techie. Bean Path oh, yeah. made me a techie. <laughs> I, I, need, I need the Bean Path. I need to be more techie. Yeah. I, we're still doing this. It's, yeah. you know? it's, it's either go to the Bean Path or become 12 years old again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, so we definitely have a lot going on. Um, we just want to celebrate what we've been doing in the community, everything that we have planned. And, and Bean Path is really for everyone, I like to say. So everyone can come out and find their space at the Bean Path and connect to all the great programming that we have there. Cool. Do, do you have to buy tickets for any of these events or anything no, like that? No, these events are free. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> free and open to the community. At our community event, we do have um, giveaways. We have food vendors there while they last. So we encourage encourage everybody to come out just have a great time it's a good family friendly event for people of all ages yeah. how about a volunteering uh, do you need volunteers we always need volunteers um, if do you, you have to be tacky you do not have to be tacky <laughs> you don't have to be tacky just willing to serve so if you visit uh, our website thebeanpath.org you'll see a little uh, blurb that says volunteer and you can sign up to be a volunteer I love it and I yeah. love the name yeah and I'm sure you've got all the activities on your your website too. Yes. No, okay so oh, they're on our website they're also on our social media on Instagram Facebook and LinkedIn well, of, of course, course they are <laughs> <laughs> why would we think differently uh, oh all right Kanika uh, Welch thank you so much for being with us I've learned a lot thank you I enjoy coming I need to learn more of this <laughs> okay yeah. all right we'll be right back stay with us